the pretty dramatic circumstances at the end there mm. and before the game. What did you make of, especially the ending and the way the game was scored off? Well, obviously, um, the lightning put the lights out for a little bit and they, they called the game off. So, I, as far as I'm concerned, the, the rule is after 45 minutes, uh, the game's abandoned after that and the score stands. So, not uh, obviously, you know, we were in control of that game. Obviously, they were chasing it as well towards the end there, but uh, we defended really well. We played well, especially after 15, 20 minutes. Uh, I think they were on top of us for the first 15, 20 minutes until we adjusted to the pace of it after a short turnaround. But uh, after that, I thought we were very good. We created a lot of chances. Again, Liam Reddy was very good again tonight for them. And I think we had 24 shots or something like that. So, um, but very good opportunity. Some very good crosses as well coming into the box now with Bobo, which frees up Costa, I think, a little bit more as well. So it's, uh, it's coming along nicely. Do you have any sympathy for Richard Garcia? Would you be a bit frustrated yeah. in the same circumstances? Of course you would be. Um, you know, when there's a couple of minutes left in the game, I suppose um, you always think you can get a goal. So, um, but rules are rules. Do you feel like you've gone up 11 hours a team, four wins in your last six, and all of a sudden just five points off top spot? Yeah, we were always going to do it. We, we got the players to do it. It was just about cutting out the silly mistakes that we're making, and I think um, we are doing that now. We're obviously a couple of clean sheets as well in a row. The goals are starting to come as well. Again, we probably could have had a lot more tonight, I think, and uh, would have made the game a lot easier for us. Um, maybe could have made a couple of subs earlier as well, which we've got another big game in a couple of days' time here again, uh, well, Leichhardt on Saturday, so and that's another big game for us. Uh. It seems like Bobo playing as the, the main man has allowed Costa to play in a wider position. Have you got the best dynamic now, do you think, moving forward up front? I think it's working really well at the moment. The, both of them, I think, you know, Bobo's starting to get fitter as well. You can see the, the havoc he causes, you know, with his head. Uh, he holds the ball up really well. And then you've got Costa making runs off him. And, um, you know, the team playing well at the moment. So, played some really good football tonight. I'm very pleased. It, it's tough after a short turnaround as well. They had an extra couple of days in us as well with the, t uh, with the turnaround. So, I'm, I'm very pleased with the, the performance overall. Yeah, just a word on the strikers. Any he is. He should be involved next game against City so on Saturday. So he's been training now for about a week, over a week. So, uh, yeah, he could find himself on the bench. And just also with um, Retro, he's sort of been it's almost locked in at that centre mid spot. Are you going to see Nguyen off? Yeah, I knew he had a bit of a sore back actually uh, today. We, that's why we had to leave him out. So it was best we left him out today and try and get him ready for the City game. So, yeah, he will. He will be back, he will get opportunities. Uh, Bratz is on four yellow cards. I think both of them are actually on four yellow cards. So at some stage you'll see Newey back, but we want him 100% fit before he comes back to give him the best possible opportunity to, to play well like he has been doing. So, um, but yeah, he's, he'll be hopefully ready for Saturday as well. And the two home games coming up, both tough. How important is it to build momentum now? Yeah, very important. Uh, two more home games, uh, tough opposition, but uh, this is what we look forward to, massive games like that. We've got City and then uh, obviously, I think Adelaide you know, after eight days after that. So um, yeah, we can build momentum. I think we're doing it already at the moment. Um, a good couple of results for us. Um, performance wise, I'm very pleased. Defensively, very strong as well. And uh, good performances all around. And so we're scoring a lot of goals in the second half. What did you put that down to? Fitness, uh, the boys are very fit. Obviously our, our staff has done a great job with them. Um, and you know, obviously we, we work hard on trying to keep the ball and, and keep teams pinned in. And I think we did that again tonight. We did it uh, in Perth as well, but I think we did it even better tonight. Uh, not letting them out once we had them in there. And the ball kept coming back. We kept getting it back in there and, and we kept building pressure on them and, and did really well. Guys, anything from uh, the Zoom call? Vince, uh, I think Pete's on there somewhere as well. Anyone else? Uh, Sorry, Vince, can you just repeat that? Sorry. Turn it up. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm confident they will. They're, they're doing nothing wrong. They're hitting the target. Uh, I thought Liam Reddy made a couple of fantastic saves again tonight, and, and that's all that's uh, stopping us at the moment. So, um, you know, we, we built confidence last week, scoring three goals. Yeah, we could have scored more tonight, but um, sometimes a 1-0 win is even sometimes better uh, for confidence as well for the team. Obviously, keeping another clean sheet, that's very important for us. Um, and the goals will come. We have the quality of players um, to put them away. And, uh, and just got Trent having him back in the City game, I mean, he was a big part of what you were planning to see. So how good is it going to be now? Hopefully have not only him, but Bobo, looks fit and do it well, and now Costa as well. Yeah, it'd be great to have him back because I think we've missed him as well, especially that sort of pace up front. Luke Ivanovic has been doing really well when he's been coming on or even started... Uh, I think in uh, Melbourne it was, or when it was when he started. Um, yeah, but it's good to have him back. He's been out quite a while. He had a very good ACL campaign for us, scored a, a lot of goals, and maybe uh, he will help out with that department as well. But um, obviously, numbers at this time of year is important. Trent's a big part of what we started at the, you know, started this season with him, and um, we're, we're looking forward to having him back.